Holy Spirit, we are ready. Holy Spirit, we are here. Holy Spirit, we are ready. Holy Spirit, have your way. Yes, Holy Spirit, have your way. Teach us. We are ready. We want to learn how to understand the scriptures. Hi, everyone. I hope everyone is fine. Our evening devotion is taken from the book of the kingdom. Sometimes does this to me. Our evening devotion is taken from the book of Acts chapter 8, verse 30. Do you understand what you are reading? The Holy Spirit has to help you to understand what you are reading. The Holy Spirit is the most suitable teacher. And without the Holy Spirit's help, we will just be fooling around. And this morning I had to read through my prophetic verse three times. And I actually had to ask the Holy Spirit to help me before I could really understand like word for word. When the prophet Daniel desired to interpret Nebuchadnezzar's dream, what did he do? He set himself to sincere prayer that God would open up his vision. That was the same thing Joseph did. The Apostle John in his vision on Patmos saw a book sealed with seven seals that no one was found worthy to open or to even look upon. And he had to cry. He began to weep greatly. Revelation chapter 5 verse 4. And it was afterwards opened by the lion of the tribe of Judah. Revelation chapter 5 verse 5. So those tears were his liquid prayer. We have to pray and pray without ceasing for the Holy Spirit to guide us, to open our eyes, to even read properly, open our minds to understand, right? Oh my goodness, this is just so beautiful. So like Daniel, you will understand the dream and its interpretation when you have sought God. And like John, you will see the seven seals of precious truth on loose after you have wept much. Stones are only broken when we need them, right? And we use a proper hammer, prayer, fasting, Bible study, studying the word and all of that. You can force your way through anything with the power of prayer. Prayer is the lever that forces open the iron chest of sacred mystery so that we can get the treasures hidden within. And that's why I will wrap up by saying, Holy Spirit, teach us, teach us just even how to read and how to seek God properly. Help us, for without you we are lost. Holy Spirit.